Hey, you! Yes, you. Are you a fan of aliens and conspiracy theories? No? Well, how about psychics and ghosts? Not quite. Maybe a spunky rom-com might be more your speed? If not, then how about some of the most interesting character writing you'll ever see in a shonen title, paired with jaw-dropping visuals, unparalleled creature design, and a healthy scoop of great humor? If that doesn't do it for you, seek help! If it does, then I'm happy to report that you'll love Don Da Don. What's up, anime fans and manga readers? The best recommendation show on the planet has returned, and you should already know the drill at this point. We have an absolute banger lined up for you today on today's episode of You Should Probably Watch. But this time, there's a little twist. Are you perhaps in an anime slump? It's nothing to be ashamed of. It happens to the very best of us. Sometimes the flashy lights and loud noises just become a little too stimulating to the brain, and we need to take a back seat. Take some time off from the constant stimulation and just breathe. You got this. I already know somebody's watching this video right now and going, breathing, relaxing? What is this, my therapist's office? I need my dopamine fix, Manga Mundo. That's why I watch anime in the first place. Well, allow me to provide you with an alternative, reading. Yes, we talk about anime a lot, but we are still a channel focused on the medium that is manga. And given that the series I'm about to introduce you to today does not have an anime adaptation yet, a manga is going to be our recommendation for you today. So strap in because this one in particular is a real wild ride. Insane, some might say. Dandadan is a manga series written and illustrated by Yukinobu Tatsu. You can find it on Shueisha's Shonen Jump Plus app and website, and it's been running since April 2021. They've already dropped 14 Tankoban volumes as of April 2024. The nerds like me out there might already be familiar with the history of the mangaka and recognize him as a former assistant to the author of one of the most critically acclaimed mangas from the last few years, Chainsaw Man. Yukinobu Tatsu decided to finally lock in and do his own thing, and boy, what a thing it is. The plot of Dandadan follows two high schoolers, Momo Ayase and Ken Takakura. Ayase believes in the existence of ghosts, but not aliens. On the other hand, her classmate Ken, or Okarun as basically every character in the manga calls him, believes in aliens and UFOs, but not ghosts. To settle the debate, they make a bet to visit locations associated with both the occult and the supernatural. The idea was to each visit a spooky site in their city associated with the concepts they did not believe in. So Ayase checks out an abandoned hospital known for its rumors of alien sightings, while Okarun heads to a railway tunnel known for being a popular haunted spot in town. When they arrive, well, it turns out both aliens and ghosts are real. Dandadan speeds off from there and never looks back. It drags you headfirst into the absolute wackiness of the world the author has built to showcase his unique vision for both aliens and ghosts. In just about every new chapter of Dandadan, there is a new absurd creature that our dynamic duo has to fend off, and each one is unique in its design and abilities while maintaining the feeling that it belongs in the world of the series alongside all the others. And when I say this manga is a absurd, I mean it in the most literal sense possible, and that's not a bad thing. Take for instance, near the beginning of the story, Okarun, the male protagonist, enters into some sort of contract with a demon slash ghost entity called, I kid you not, Turbo Granny. Now this is a trope we see a lot in anime and manga, from Naruto to Jujutsu Kaisen to Chainsaw Man. Where Dandadan stands out is in the nature of this contract, is when Turbo Granny takes Okarun's balls as the cost for binding with her. It's so completely wild, so unexpected, but presented with the most utmost sincerity that you can't help but take it serious, even while acknowledging that it is funny. Another example is this one character with an inflatable dinosaur bodysuit that can transform into a giant mecha. Or this race of shape-shifting aliens that are only interested in collecting people's bananas for science. The out-of-pocket characters and situations, as hilarious as they are, are far from the best aspects of Dandadan. 
Its main strength lies in the characters. The lead duo have amazing chemistry with each other as friends and partners, and the romance that has been teased between them since the beginning is being built up slowly and naturally. The cast of supporting characters is amazing as well, with standouts being the aforementioned Turbo Granny, ISA's grandmother Seiko, who doesn't look a day over 30 by the way, Aida Shiratori, another classmate bound to a demon like Okarun, Gigi, who's possessed by an ancient entity called the Evil Eye, Mr. Mantis Shrimp Shikitita, look, the list is long and exhausting, and like I always say, the best way to know characters is to experience them yourself. Even in its absurdity, Dandadan draws impactful and emotional threads between all of these characters, endearing the audience to them in just a short few chapters. The art is generally considered to be among the best in any shonen series being published today, with many fans wondering just how Yukinobu Tatsu can knock out pages like this, or this, week after week! With an anime scheduled to air later this year in October, I, for one, am curious to see just how it will be adapted because the manga certainly does not make it easy. With the adaptation down the line, there's no better time to pick up this series and give it a go. Every page will surprise you. Anyway, that's all we have for today, folks. Do you agree with our pick? Maybe there are some really cool facts about Dan Dan that I left out. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and ring the notification bell to get regular updates on new videos. I make awesome anime and manga content like this every week, so be sure to check them out. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.